Hey guys, what's going on? This is Josh from joshelder.com and in this video, I wanna show you a new tool that I came across. It's called vidIQ, in case you're not familiar with it. And it's pretty cool. There's so many different things that this tool can do. Uh, what you can do is you can go to vidIQ.com forward slash apps forward slash vision. And I'll also include the link in the description here. Uh, but there's so many different things this, this software can do, this plugin can do. Uh, it can sort of reverse engineer other channels, what's working on other channels. So you can model what's working, videos that are ranking on other channels and use them to your own benefit on your channel. So what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna show you how to find tags that other videos are using so you can better optimize your video for the same keywords so you can get up there and take the number one spot and rank at the top of YouTube search engine. So all you need to do is go to this website, download it, and then once you download it and install it on Chrome, what you'll want to do is go to YouTube and then type in the keyword that you're looking to rank for and see the competition. And then what you'll want to do is just simply go through, you know, the top two or the top three videos. That's where really, you know, 80% or 90% of the traffic comes from. And you'll click on these videos. So I'll click on the first video. And what you'll notice on the right hand side is all the video tags that Jennifer is using to rank her video. Now, obviously there's other factors in ranking such as engagement, right? Views, uh, likes, dislikes, comments, shares. And to actually get that info, what I like to do is I like to go to statistics. And you can see, obviously the time watched, five days, 6,000 views, 37 subscriptions driven, 16 shares. And then you got your likes and dislikes and you got your views over here. Most importantly, you've got your video tags. So you can see the video tags and even the channel tags that she's using to rank her videos, right? So she's ranking for free leads online, free online leads. She's ranking number five here, number five here, generate leads online free, number six here. How to get free leads from my business online, number one. Um, obviously how to get leads from my business. She's also ranking number one, she's at the top there how to get leads for free. So just different variations of how to get free leads online or just how to get free leads in general. So how to get free leads for your business, how to generate free leads online, how can I get free leads for my business or how can I get leads for my business. So you guys kind of get the idea and you can see exactly what she's doing along with you know her title, her description, right she obviously has how to get free leads for your business so this video is really all about getting free leads but she's also ranking for just how to get leads for my business so pretty cool and then you can obviously check out the description find out what she's doing she's obviously keyword stuffing down here now me personally i wouldn't recommend doing this i also wouldn't recommend having so many different uh, tags that are so similar because I believe later on YouTube will be cracking down on that um, so you can tell that she's really trying to optimize for this keyword and over optimize that's something you want to be careful of when you're optimizing your videos is over optimization um, but I'd like to take this data sort of just with a, a grain of salt something to model after something to kind of get a general rule of thumb from um, to use in my video. So I know if I'm creating a video on how to get lead, free leads for my business, that I might you know, take a few of these keywords out of here. Obviously I'd determine what the search volume is for um, the, my primary keyword and my secondary keywords. And I definitely wanna go for keywords that get the most searches. And maybe include two, three, maybe four uh, video tags, but nothing more than that. So. Go ahead and get access to this, this software, this plugin. It's 100% free. Obviously they do have different upgrades that you can upgrade to, but this is what I primarily use it for right now. Um, 
they also, when you're creating a video, they'll give you an SEO score, uh, which is basically a score from zero to 100 to determine how well, how well optimized your video is. You know, if your, your primary keywords in the title, the description, and the tags, you know, if you're using closed captions on your videos, um, that's obviously very effective. That's working really well right now on YouTube as well. So, hope you guys got some value from this video. If you did like this video, please subscribe to my channel. I'm always giving you value on you know, YouTube, marketing, how to get more traffic, leads, and sales online, and how to overall build a business and life full of freedom, passion, fulfillment. So. Subscribe to my channel, like this video, and comment below what questions do you have about vidIQ? Um, what questions do you have about SEO and optimizing your tags on your video? So with that said, this is Josh from joshelder.com signing off from beautiful Maui, Hawaii. Check out this beautiful view. Not too bad. I've been able to enjoy this for the past uh, about five days or so. And today we're gonna go do a little bit of snorkeling, maybe a little bit of hiking. Just relax and wind down after our free day mastermind. So take care of you guys. We'll talk to you soon and we'll see you in future videos.